What's up guys, I'm Alan with Edge Auto Support and I'm going to show you guys that are purchasing e-tunes from us how to go in and change the data log parameters uh, that we're asking you to log uh, for the e-tuning process. It's really easy, all you have to do is go to the gauge screen, you're going to click the up button and go to setup and then it'll be configure data logging, select that and you're going to go through this list and you're going to make sure that only the parameters that uh, I've sent you in the welcome email are selected in your data logging. Uh, we want to make sure that only those are uh, selected because each one takes up a certain amount of space and we only have room for so much. So uh, just go, you go through and you hit this button to select or you hit it to deselect depending on what uh, parameters are being requested. To take a data log, all you have to do is go to the gauge screen you can see up here it says not logging. Uh, to log, you're just going to click the center button. It's going to wait for a second while the lights blink, and now it's logging. And you can see it's logging. It is not actually logging until that says logging. So you always want to make sure you see that before you begin whatever process the data log requires. Uh, after you've completed the data log, uh, you can click the center button again and it stops taking the log and it is now saved so that when you go to Access Port Manager, it is there ready to download and email to your eTuner.